Discover how to track keyword performance over time for any product. One of my absolute favorite tools in Helium 10 is historical trends. And this feature lets you view the history of keywords for which a product has ranked both organically and through sponsored ads. But why is this important and how can it make you more money? Well, tools like Cerebro are gonna give you a snapshot of a product's current performance on Amazon, showing you where it ranks now. However, what if you're selling in a seasonal, seasonal niche or are curious about sales trends during specific times like November or the peak summer months? For example, if you're checking Cerebro for a beach ball in December, the keywords driving traffic then are quite different usually than those in June or July. So understanding these seasonal shifts is crucial for optimizing your strategy. Historical trends also allows you to uncover patterns in your competitors ad strategies or their organic reach. You can identify if they're leveraging outside campaigns that are resulting in temporary spikes or, you know, different times of the year. Or if you're ready to dive deeper, we're going to go ahead and explore this data a little bit more. So if you go here, you can see that um, I've actually done a search on one of our competitors here, and I'm going to click on where it says show historical trend under where it says keyword distribution in Cerebro. And what this is going to do is it pulls up the last 24 months of data of keyword data for organic and sponsored keywords. So you can see that, you know, this has in May of 2023, this product had 337 sponsored product keywords and 1,064 organic keywords. And you can see kind of maybe spikes in time where potentially they were giving some, you know, outside traffic to help boost the organic rank or something like that. But you can also see, okay, there was a, a good amount of spend in October, a little bit less in November, December was going down, and then there's no spend or anything in January. And over here, January and February are super low. So that's an indication that, you know, maybe you should adjust your PPC strategy to follow that and maybe not advertise in those months where it really doesn't seem to pay off. Um, so this is all some really good insights that you can see um, in this historical trend tool. Now there's definitely way more that you can actually see, but that's just kind of uh, the tip of the iceberg where you can go back 24 months. You can see what's going on with what your competitor is doing. Are they, you know, doing advertising during a certain time of year that really spikes um, through those sponsored product ads, or, you know, are they sending outside traffic and seeing a lot more of organic reach? Um, you can see a lot of that data and information through this tool. So check it out and let us know what you think.